Hi, my name is Colby Duke with IdeaForge Technology. I manage business development and customer support. Today we're going to review the Netra V4 Pro. So as you can see here, this is our Netra V4 Pro uh, quadcopter that flies for over 90 minutes. And when we say 90 minutes, customers are consistently getting over 90 minutes every single flight. It comes with three separate payloads. Uh, one of the payloads you see here is the daylight uh, daylight sensor with a 27x zoom and 4, 4x digital zoom. And then we have our FLIR sensor here, 640 by 480 uh, thermal payload. And then for our mapping uh, and, and uh, surveying customers, we have our 20 megapixel uh, mapping payload as well. Going back to the performance, 90 minutes of flight time and with paired with the mapping payload, that's going to get you two square miles of survey grade level mapping in one flight. So less changes of batteries, you know, you're spending less money on consumables, your total cost of ownership is going to be drastically lower than some of the other products on the market. So the Netra V4 Pro will be paired with our flight controller, proprietary flight control software, which is called Bluefire Touch. Bluefire Touch, as you can see here, uh, playing on, a, on the iOS platform uh, with an iPad. Here's your map screen, here's your video screen, extremely seamless, easy to use. We have pre-flight planning tools on this side, uh, as mentioned, this is a waypoint navigation based system. Uh, on the bottom here is going to be your uh, communications tab for your communication box. We have built in streaming uh, where you can stream to multiple devices, whether it's iPhones, computers, uh, iPads. If you have officers on the ground or need, need uh, increased situational awareness, they can download the application on the, on the App Store, uh, give them the access and or control key. The control key will allow them to control the payload uh, from anywhere in the world. So as long as you have internet on the GCS, you can control the payload individually for that UAV. You can't fly the UAV, uh, but you can control the camera and uh, uh, during operation. So hit start streaming, uh, and then you can allow remote user control at any time or take it away, uh, which is a great feature. Um, you can see some of your flight characteristics here, GPS, altitude, um, and then your, uh, some of your flight modes, take off land, your uh, RPV mode, which is like your manual mode, land, hold, you know, hold your position, uh, and then track. So you can do essentially an active track, uh, you know, click the, uh, the track button over here, click your target, uh, and if you're in track mode, it's gonna follow that target. Uh, or you can, you can remove track mode and still enable tracking. Uh, and it'll just track uh, via the camera. A lot of cool features. We're receiving a lot of good feedback. You know, there, there's so much information on here that really enables the pilot to uh, ensure it's their safety during flight. Um, and something you can't see here, because this is a video playback, but uh, we do have ADS-B in uh, on, the, on the software itself. So as you're flying, you have your communication box enabled. Uh, the ADS-B feature will see all active uh, aircraft in the area that are transmitting with it via ADS-B. You'll see the tail number as well as the altitude. So um, that's come in pretty handy recently, uh, flying around, you know, you know, 400 feet, uh, but having small manned aircraft in the area, you know, we can navigate that accordingly. So the way this software was developed, um, as mentioned, it's a, it's a fully it's fully autonomous. So um, we know that you know whoever's whoever's flying this drone, they have a mission in mind, uh, but they also have other responsibilities. So um, you could you could pick anybody on the force um, that, that, that might need to use this for any surveillance operation or if you're doing precision agriculture, um, you know, get a, give them a walkthrough on the, on the software. You can launch, uh, launch the UAV up in the air and the UAV is going to fly itself. So if you're, do, if you're running surveillance operation, all you need to worry about is the camera. The UAV is going to take care of itself. So there's four built-in fail safes uh, that's built into the software and the UAV. You have your high wind fail safe, which is max wind is uh, about 26 miles per hour. You have your uh, bat battery fail safe, where uh, depending where you're at, um, the, the com computer, onboard computer is always calculating based on your location, how much volts you have in your battery, uh, you know, and, and, and also wind is taken into account uh, for how long it's gonna take to get the UAV, UAV back to home. Another fail safe is the high vibration. So if you're um, maybe, your propellers are loose, there's something on the UAV that's causing vibrations, uh, the onboard computer will sense that and then bring it back to home as well. So the Netra V4 Pro is extremely light. 
Uh, the total weight uh, with everything included here is about 13 pounds. Uh, the, the propellers and the frame are all carbon fiber and Kevlar. The propellers here uh, are, have a twist kick dis excuse me, quick disconnect mechanism, as you can see here, and they're easily removed and or installed. Great for quick deployment, quick response. Um, we can get this aircraft assembled and up in the air in less than five minutes.